Hi, uh, my name is Rourke, and uh, I uh, graduated from the Camera Culture Group led by Ramesh here at the Media Lab in 2011, and it's great to be back. Um, and I recently started a company named Ramona Optics, uh, along with uh, my co-founder Mark, and we're making the world's first gigapixel microscope. Um, and so we all love images, and we also all love it when a new camera or phone comes out and the images get better. Um, and the same is true with microscopes. So the microscopes of today are getting bigger, higher resolution, seeing a larger area, and higher quality. Um, but there, this comes with a cost. It's really tough to make these giant um, microscopes, and it's expensive. So as we transition from the megapixel images that we all love today um, to the gigapixel images that we're all going to want in the future for our cameras or for our microscopes, um, the cost increases exponentially. But we all know that these camera phones are great and perform really well. We all have them in our pocket. And we also know that they're probably pretty cheap. So it costs about a dollar to make a cell phone camera module. And so at Ramona Optics, we are leveraging this and combining lots of these camera sensors into a large array and then using some clever algorithms to combine all of the images together into a final result that gives you very high resolution over a huge area. This is one of our first prototypes. It contains approximately 100 individual lenses and sensors and can capture gigapixel video over, for a microscope, a field of view that's quite large, uh, 100 centimeters square. And this is our first beta product, which I'm happy to announce. It's now available. Um, and this is what people are using it for. So in neuroscience, we have customers using it to watch the behavior and simultaneously measure the neural activity via fluorescence of hundreds of organisms as they move around and, inter and interact together. In biology, you can watch the growth of biofilms or other bacteria over unprecedentedly, unprecedentedly large areas. And then in industry, you can uh, inspect parts at larger scales and at higher resolution and thus higher throughput um, than has ever been possible before. And most importantly, this technology can scale. We simply add more cameras. And so in the future, our technology, we hope, will give us the gigapixel images that we're going to want. Uh, we have a demo set up. I can show you some of the gigapixel images. Um, and if you work in biomedical space or in manufacturing, and this could be of help to you, please stop by and let me know. All right, thanks. Thank you.